Princeton James, and uh, I'm here to talk a little bit about Calgary Stampede. You know, it's a, an awesome, awesome privilege to be a part of the Calgary Stampede, and you know, everybody wants to be there, and it just, it's really, really cool to actually add it to my list of places I've been, but it's uh, it's kind of a sad thing that it's not happening this year. Um, you know, it's a lot of people that uh, are really, really ready and really, really waiting on uh, this special event, but uh, it's okay. It's all going to be okay. Uh, next year is going to be bigger and better, and I cannot wait for that. But uh, while I sit here at home for uh, these couple weeks and not doing much of nothing, I uh, think back to my favorite time at Calgary. And uh, I mean, every time you step foot even close to that arena, you see things that are absolutely outstanding from Bulls After Dark to all the amazing people to all the amazing riders that can come out to the show. But uh, I think my biggest, biggest thing that I will always be burned in my brain is the very first year I got there, which was two years ago, I showed up, I think it was probably like a day seven or maybe day five, and uh, I stood on the very end of the arena, outside of the arena, with my back against the panels, looking at the massive grandstand and all the people, and to see everybody just, and just clap their hands, just makes your whole body shake and it's uh, there's nothing like that throughout the whole world the feeling you get all those people looking at you so i can't wait for that and i can't wait to be back ringside right there with all you guys at the calgary stampede